What's that thing? Bigfoot. There you go. <laughs> like, is it mythical or not? It's true what they say about Bigfoot, too. Big feet. Big <laughs> feet. <laughs> His feet are huge. His feet are huge. <laughs> Whoa. Hey. What's going on, race team? This is Evan at Go Power Sports here in Fort Worth, Texas. This is uh, Jesus from uh, Go Power Sports in Fort Worth, Texas. Welcome to WTFAQ. What does that mean? Uh, like, what the frequently asked question is basically oh, what I'm thinking going Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. I was trying to say WTF, okay. Right. <laughs> We're going that route. We're here to uh, address some questions that y'all might have uh, before they even come up. Hey, Seuss, why doesn't the stage one kit include a header pipe? Good question. All right, so the reason it doesn't come with a header pipe is because we don't know what application is going on. There's Comans out there, there's, there's Bajas, there's Doodlebugs, Mancos, Yerf Dogs, Carters. The list goes on and on and on and on and on. We can be here all day. The main reason is we specifically have certain pipes for certain setups, so we don't include it, so we can make it easier for you guys, and we don't want you to be limited on your options. For stage two as well, oh. 225 Tilly, no matter what motor you got, if you're putting a header pipe, it matters on what application. We always ask what you got before we send them a pipe. Mm. Yes, sir. Okay. Solid. Okay, so question is, what's the difference between a stage one Tilly and a stock Tilly? That's easy. Your stock Tilson is going to have the governor intact. It's going to have your stock airbox and your stock exhaust manifold. So what's all on the stage one? Okay. You replace the, of course, the air box. Put, the, put your filter here with the adapter. Of course, it comes with one. You get your filter sock, governor removal, self-tapping bolt to cover that hoe up, the jet for your carb, carb gaskets, and that makes it a stage one. What's all in a stage two? The stage two consists of your billet rod, your billet flywheel, your aftermarket cam, a side cover gasket, a 10 thousandths head gasket for increased compression, and a racing spark plug. Hold on, what's up with the valve spring? Well, you actually don't have to change the valve springs in the Tiltson because it comes factory <laughs> with 22 pounders, double deucers as we like to call them. Yes, sir. The double douche. <laughs> What is the tilts and flywheel made out of? Cast aluminum. It is a lightweight flywheel, uh, rated at 10,000 RPM. But <clears throat> it's, it, uh, once you do like a stage two, you do need to change out the, to a billet flywheel. So that is the difference on it. But it is rated at 10,000 RPM, and it is not 100% aluminum. It's cast aluminum. The reason why you do your billet flywheel and your billet rod these two things in itself don't really make you faster. Your billet flywheel allows you to get better acceleration off the line because obviously it's lighter, less drag. But the reason why you do these things is because if you were to try to get higher RPMs with your stock internals, you're gonna sling the magnets out of your flywheel. Your rod is gonna pack its bags and leave out of the front of the engine. And it's just bad news bears. So. The, it's really more just bulletproofing your engine, if you will, but also uh, it just helps everything run more efficiently and thus making horsepower. So, What kind of oil should we use on these Tiltsons? Well, for sure you want to use the break-in you got over there to break it in with the high zinc. It'll give you the best break-in. Condition that, your internal parts. Yes, sir. And then once you've got it going and you want to put the four-stroke, the Tillerson four-stroke is our recommended one. All right, it's a, if you want to give it the best shelf life on your on your motor and you want to ride and have fun, this is the way to go, baby. It tastes better. Low than temperature your properties. Oil. I can do that. Extra anti-wear properties. That sounds kind of like Bill Nye the Science Guy. Bill, 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 Bill. <laughs> Great for constipation. No, I did my turkey in this last Thanksgiving, and it came out pretty good. It was bomb. That's the one I had. It was real bomb. Yeah, it was good. <laughs> Question is, what is the pro setup on a Tillerson? What it goes on with the pro setup is we make sure that everything is running efficiently right out of the box. Your valve lash is checked. Your spark plug is checked. 
your throttle linkage is checked. All you've got to do is add oil and gas to this bad boy and let her rip. That's pretty much it. Brap, brap. Womp, womp, skirp, skirp. I would like to say that um, little schoolboys play with predators, but men play with Tiltsons. You know that. Right. But if you do have questions, hit us up at 866-846-5278 and go past Hey, Sports, you remember the phone number? <laughs> That's my dude. All right, guys, thank y'all for tuning in, and we will see y'all on the next one. I am Evan. I'm Jesus. We'll catch y'all next time. All right. Can we lock it in? Is that good?